was tackling um, waste within the fashion industry uh, and I realized that uh, extending the life and use of garments is the best way we can reach our carbon, water and waste emission targets. So I wanted to come up with a solution that could balance desirability, commercial viability, um, be ethical and sustainable. Um, it has to be desirable because if no one likes your invention, then no one's going to adopt it. I could um, balance ethical and sustainable solutions with a desirable and commercially viable outcome, but I would just have to focus on a very niche user group, which is children and designed for their rapidly growing bodies. So I used my background in origami and deployable structures and applied that to children's wear to design children's wear that would expand and deploy out to custom fit a range of ages. So the design uh, really takes a holistic approach to adding value to every stakeholder along the value chain. So taking the environment as one uh, stakeholder. Uh, we use recycled bottles to manufacture the rule and textile. From a manufacturing perspective, we have a streamlined manufacturing process where we're making one particular size and not seven different sizes. So this can mean fewer offcuts and much fewer logistics, which saves CO2 emissions. But the biggest and most exciting thing, I think, is inspiring the next generation. So being able to have that direct line of conversation with the next generation and say, things can be designed differently and to help them aspire to be engineers and astronauts and to think out of the box, I think is the, the thing that myself and the team are the most proud of. But we do take a holistic approach and even our packaging is, turns into a toy. Um, so it, it's a zero waste concept that, again, isn't adding um, waste to the world, but is showing people that actually we can be so resourceful if we just uh, think about everything that we're designing and putting out into the world. Uh, there's a really nice uh, saying, which we use it particularly, and that is, our earth isn't inherited from our elders, but it's borrowed from our children. And I think that fits in very well uh, into the way we like to operate. 